So welcome to Hot and Cold. Uh, today we're going to make a little review in regards to a desk that I just got. This um, the Boho desk. I know that uh, it is in the version of the Easy Line, Easy Desk. It's actually this one, Easy Desk Line. One of the one of the complaints I will actually have about these guys is that they give me the whole montage in, in German. The whole installation took me about 45 minutes anyway because it's pretty much straightforward. Everything they're looking for. In, and the image is, is, is very clear, but um, I think it is just a, it is a, a small video that it is a little bit outside of the content of what I used to do. But of course, it's just to to anyone that's out there just looking for a, a desk and is having some some decisions in regards to this because it is something that's healthy and it's going to be good for anyone that's working the same way as I'm, I'm working right now. So. I hope that you like it and see you next time. Look at this. I'm going to make a little test here in regards to say 110 for example. And while I move it, I just wanted to capture this glass of water and the microphone that it is up there to see how much does it move. Also the monitor as well. movement of the desk itself is pretty pretty smooth. Now it comes to the next text, which is 110. We can do like this. Same. We'll go to the side here to move a little bit here. That's how much does it move. So this is 110, and I'm moving like this with my hand, right? So it, of course, when it's such a such a high situation, such a high point, does not come with such a good. Let's see a bit more down. is a lot less but the thing is that of course at this desk if you if you want to have a proper measurement for these kind of things probably you will not do it like this it's just intuitive way of doing so but uh, it contains it contains a little bit of the value of, of in regards to how much stable is this the most stable point i think is going to be in the center of the desk at some point right and the thing is that also, how much weight does it have on top of it? It is recommended to have about 80 kilograms uh, by the Boho company. So, when it is in regards to this, um, and you have this, this kind of test that it is about 80 kilograms, more probably these two legs are going to stay much better. I have to put a bit of order there in the cover management, although it is not the best cover management I did. And I'm not as good in regards to that, but it is alright. So far so good, it's going to be okay for me. So... Uh, the thing is that... 
this desk comes in price tag of about 400 euros without the top with the top is about i think it's about 150 euros more uh, this top is from boho as well uh, boho is a very young company as far as i see but the components all of the components that come here that are with these actuators are done with linac linac has a lot of a lot more of um, time in the market than boho so in the cards of the control itself it looks a lot a lot better from my point of view in regards to where is the other case uh, it has also an application that you can mix with this controller <coughs> how they are the connector with the bluetooth and yeah and basically a very good desk for the price i think and um, if you want to have it more stable on the top as you just saw this 80 centimeters right yeah, this is 80 centimeters so. see i'm i'm really moving it right i'm doing my best and i think that it's as much as it moves there right uh, if you want to have better quality and stability of the desk when it is higher, then you need to have a higher price. That's my guess. But in itself, this is 180 per 80, this desk. And if you have about 80 kilograms, probably this will be more stable. And it is, I think it is a pretty nice, pretty nice for the value, right? Pretty nice, pretty nice price for the value. So. Hope that you like it and have a good one. See you next time. Ciao, ciao.